Uy. What is up mga kapotpot? Magandang tanghali po sa inyo or magandang gabi uh, kasi you're watching this or uh, anyway this is just a, a bonus clip of uh, my channel and uh, medyo seryoso lang yung vlog natin this afternoon because I'm gonna show you the this is with regards the recent development of the COVID-19 here in our country particularly here in NCR so there has been a report of positive cases of the COVID-19 that's why the government has to take actions uh, of the said uh, dilemma of our country okay so what, what I'm about to show you is the situation here in Metro Manila and CR uh, here in Ortigas and Pasig so pakita ko sa inyo ano yung mga traffic situation or ano yung mga recent uh, ano nila ano yung mga recent uh, developments of the said uh, crisis okay so sama niya na lang ako sa aking activity as we check on the situation dito alright so yeah. on the problems well, masyado makitid ang parking namin dito Are we clear? Okay, we are clear. Alright guys, so we're here in Ortigas and it seems like um, business is uh, operational. Uh, okay pa din naman, uh, though medyo nabawas na yung volume lang tao. Today is Friday. Today is Friday pero, ayun o. Oh. Eh, hindi ganun kakapal yung tao, yung volume ng tao ngayon dito. So... Oh, tignan natin dito sa may Ortigas Avenue. By the way, I'm using Thomas 400. Itong uh, uh, Motorstar Cafe 400 natin. Wow. So, ganun pa rin naman. Traffic pa rin dito. <laughs> Pero yesterday guys, so oh, nung inannounce yung lockdown, yung uh, maling balita. <laughs> Grabe, sobrang ano, sobrang uh, konti ng tao sa kalsada. I iba yung ano. And siguro dahil Friday kaya ganito yung traffic situation dito. Sa mga negosyante, hindi pwede yung mga tigil yung negosyo eh. Pero yesterday was uh, ramdam ko yung ano eh, yung impact sa tao nung uh, scare of the ano, COVID-19 and uh, lockdown. So, maling balita. So, anyway guys, hindi ko ako nagbabalita about the COVID-19. Uh, this is just uh, the uh, actual situation here in pa Pasig. NCR or Metro Manila so Ortigas and uh, I'm just sharing to you uh, my personal opinion so uh, I'm not a newscaster so don't expect uh, uh, mga bookish terms about the virus and uh, hindi pa tayo ka aware ang alam lang natin that the COVID-19 is a uh, virus ka, uh, that came from China Wuhan, China so, ano yung mga nakita ko sa elevator namin na yun nga yung initial symptoms or yun, hindi siya ganun ka visible eh okay uh, suspected symptoms are yun nga yung coughing 
um, trangpaso, yung mahirap na paghinga, or else chest pain, etc. etc. Okay. So, for me, ah, for me lang, mga kapot-pot, I believe, eh, dito na sa atin sa Pilipinas, eh, hindi naman masyado mag- uh, centralize ang virus na yan dahil napakainit sa atin so yun tayo mga nakamotor uh, uh, better watch out then pero lagi naman tayong bilad sa araw so ako personally what I do nagda double dosage ako ng vitamins so 1000 milligrams na ako per day isa sa umaga or isa sa ano before I, I head on out sa aking mga activities then isa bago matulog so that yung immune system ko is uh, hindi ganun bumagsak okay, so nandito tayo ngayon patawid ng C5 pa baba ng Ortigas Ave extension and uh, normal pa rin ang uh, flow dito nothing major na ano pero sa condo namin napansin ko sa parking ang daming walang mga kotse uh, baka mga nagsipag uh, out of town na uh, because of the scare here in Metro Manila pero tayo dito lang muna kasi pag gumuhin tayo ng probinsya sa Norte kailang misis kalakal alam ko doon yung quarantine zone eh, sa Tarlac sa Kapas so, so wala lang feeling ko nga nandun yung virus okay, so I do suggest you do the same thing double dosage of vitamins uh, wala naman mawawala eh yan lang, yung, uh, you have to invest pero syempre, health is wealth so uh, ito yung nag-aanap buhay para sa atin and uh, I do hope sana ma, ma, ma rule out na itong uh, dilemma natin na ito, itong crisis na hinaharap ng uh, bansa natin kala mo, <laughs> serious and serious well, uh, again this is a no joke situation uh, we better take this seriously but we don't have to uh, we don't have to panic about the situation we just have we need to remain calm uh, due diligence uh, proper uh, information about the crisis or about the virus Ang ginagawa mo? Ito dito maluwag oh. Dito maluwag. Anyway, um, yun lang yung may share ko. This is the situation here in the metro. <laughs> Traffic ah. This is the situation here in the metro. With regards to the uh, COVID-19 na uh, crisis natin. Okay, so siguro mamaya ang gabi, I'm gonna head on out and I'm gonna check the situation para makagawa din ako ng sa pang vlog um, about our problem. Uh, ano yung situation pagkagabi na dito? Is it like a ghost town? Kasha ba tayo dito? Hindi. <laughs> Ipit mo ba sa Ari ka sa akin Nakamontero din ako Anyway guys so Yan lang muna eh. and it's so hot I'm doing a tanghali vlog I'm on my way to Rusi Junction because I wanna have my bike check ulit by uh, our kapotpot Jason from uh, Rusi Junction Gabi ko nga eh. you're gonna turn right eh. Is it a pay? Oh, I believe it's a payday Friday, Friday the 13th. Yeah, I got it to the 
Pero yun lang mga kapot-pot ah, I guess I'll be ending the vlog from here. Again, this is your boy, Mr. Kalakal. Now signing off. Ciao. Hirap sumingit dito kayo, Thomas Poratris. Lucky. Babush. <laughs>